In recent week, polls in Quebec are pointing towards a possible come-from-behind wind for the Liberal Party. The Parti Québécois was poised for a majority government, but now appears to be floundering. And in recent days, the PQ found a new target, the rest of Canada, and possibly students, stealing the election. Mike Armstrong explains. It would be hard for the allegation to be more serious. Three Parti Québécois candidates Sunday worded it as a question asking... Que Will the Quebec election be stolen by people from Ontario par des gens du reste du Canada. by people from the rest of Canada? Now, the issue is students. Montreal has more university students than any city in North America other than Boston. Well, the PQ over the weekend said it heard there was a massive push to get students to register so they could vote against the Parti Québécois. Revision committees in Montreal ridings were overwhelmed, they said, with students from outside Quebec trying to register. They wanted the Director General of Elections to step in. The definition of Quebecer is defined by uh, the law, so we want the law to be respected. There is no invasion. The Director General of Elections isn't nervous. In fact, he's upset. His spokesman says there is no crisis of students wanting to register and that the allegation of voter fraud undermines confidence in the electoral system. Using a formal press conference to tell us to do our duty, it was not relevant. Now, there are ridings where there is an increase in the number of students registering. Many say they've been motivated by anger over the controversial Charter of Values. But whether it would make much of a difference is unlikely. Students from Montreal's two English universities live primarily in safe liberal ridings. It has nothing to do with students. Analyst Bruce Hicks says the PQ is fear-mongering to solidify its base, trying to prevent sovereignists from voting for other sovereignist parties. Pauline Marois has moved on, her campaign today trying to focus on child care. She now says the party is reassured by the Director General of Elections. But after all the headlines over the weekend, the PQ may have gotten the message it wanted out. Mike Armstrong, Global News, Montreal.